This chart breaks down how different engines sip or chug fuel as speed increases at their cruise altitude. I'm an aerospace engineer and this is all about specific fuel consumption or SFC. SFC is measured in pounds of fuel per hour per pound of thrust created. And here's the key, lower SFC means better fuel efficiency. This is why these crossover points are so important. They show where different engine types overtake each other in efficiency as cruise speed increases. At low speeds around Mach 0.2 to 0.5, turboprops lead the pack. That's one reason why even today turboprops Props are still used on regional and utility aircraft. They're great in fuel efficiency at lower speeds. But as you move past Mach 0.5, high bypass ratio, BPR, turbofans become the most efficient option. They strike the perfect balance between fuel economy and cruise speed, which is exactly why most airlines fly right around Mach 0.8. But push past Mach 1 and things shift again. Jet engines like turbojets and low BPR turbofans like on fighter jets become more efficient. But of course, these aren't hard limits, just general trends based on typical designs and historical data. The exact crossover depends on how each engine is built and optimized, but that's the art of propulsion, matching the engine to the mission, not just the speed.